Hello guys, today I'm gonna talk about the a new little mod we're going to do on the QRX350 Pro from Valkyra. Um, we're going to talk about the GPS. Uh, this is the old one, the stock one you will get when you buy this model. And it's actually a pretty bad um, GPS. Um, I'll put a, li a link in the description which GPS is inside here because I already installed my new one. So then you can see which one it is. It's, act it's 22 euros on Banggood. It's not that much. Um, if you see what you will get for it. Um, I replaced it because this one is really a bad GPS. It doesn't do... A good job actually so when you buy the new GPS you'll get this these wires but you won't have to use them actually I'll get back to this uh, when we are installing it so I already installed mine when you're unscrewing all the screws from your body just take out the top part of the body just take it off Watch out because there will be a wire connected uh, from the old GPS. So watch out if you pull it off. Um, then you will see this with a wire coming out. Just take it off. And then you will see this. It's actually a black thing with four screws one two three four unscrew those four and then you will see um, I'm gonna do it right now so you guys can see um, there you go for you guys if you open this thing you will see the old GPS in there right now you will see the new one because I already did it yesterday um, but I'm doing it for you guys again when you buy the new one you will also get uh, an M3 sticker so here you have the new GPS um, it's actually a blue one so why you didn't have to use the wires you received when you buy this uh, um, GPS well it's because they don't fit in the Devo M so you don't have to use the wires you get when you buy this GPS just throw them away normally if you open this thing up if you uh, unscrew the screws you'll see this one right here what you have to do is take out the um, wire that will come out your old GPS take off that wire from this uh, also take this GPS from the black um, thing and put a new uh, sticker on it so you can paste the new one on there you can see here is the new one just take the old um, wire that was in the old GPS and put it in the new GPS like this paste it on there and then just screw it back into place it's actually that easy take your screws your screwdriver oh damn that was a little fail of me uh, so take your screws take your screwdriver and put it back together just like this take your screws there you go
last one. There you go. So just screw it back into place. Screw the four screws into place. Take off. Uh, take the 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 metal or you know the the um, the shielding so you won't get any interference with the other things that are on your drone like the um, transmitter your video transmitter or stuff like that just put it on like it was you have the wire right here take your drone again put the GPS in the GPS port of the Devo M Come on, go in there, come on, why isn't it, okay, there you go, it's plugged in, as you can see, then just close the body, don't screw it, just close it, what you have to do next is take your battery and your transmitter and go outside, I really recommend this to you guys go outside and put everything on like you are going to fly just connect everything and let the GPS be um, getting used to the Devo M and all the systems in your drone just let it do for a second for a couple of minutes not a second a couple of minutes like just let it do for like 10 minutes I was just sitting outside with my battery plugged in with my transmitter on and I was just sitting outside for like 10 minutes and letting my drone do its stuff you will see that it will get like after two or three minutes one blink two blinks three blinks four blinks five blinks six seven until eight it might be seven or eight or six but if you have I had like eight blinks which means I had 13 uh, satellites I never had so much I was so excited when I saw that um, so yeah um, now I'm inside I already did the uh, already plugged it in yesterday outside I can do it right now inside so uh, to to show you guys how much uh, blinks I will be getting inside in my house because uh, normally with the old GPS I w was never getting any GPS signal inside my house so uh, I hope everything works right now so I can show you guys how good this GPS actually is um, so yeah everything is running I hope it will work Wait for a second. Come on. Oh, there you go. Two blinks. One blink. One blink. Two blinks. Come on. Go higher. Yesterday I had four blinks inside looks like I'm now having just two blinks inside um, but yeah that's good enough um, to show you guys that it is actually doing so well this GPS is so much better than the old one I never had any I'm, I'm may had like two flashes outside with the old one now I'm getting them inside it's not more normal so the old, uh, the new GPS is so good. Uh, I'll, I, I total, totally recommend this to everyone who is using the Valkyra QRX350 Pro. <coughs> uh, you will get so a so much better uh, GPS signal. You will have so much blinks, like 13 or 10 satellites every time you're going to fly. You will have no problems with altitude hold or returning to home uh, or returning to land I don't know how you call it um, 
you will have such a good GPS experience and um, you will we will never have problems with it um, so yeah that was the GPS mod if you liked it um, just leave a like and maybe subscribe to my channel so I'll make some more videos about uh, mods you can do with the QRX350 Pro um, stay tuned on my channel I will make a lot more videos if you have a QRX350 Pro stay tuned look at my videos and you will learn a lot of things um, if you have any questions about your QRX350 Pro you can always ask them in the comments um, if you have any suggestion what I might do as a video just let me know and then I'll make a video about it for you guys um, so yeah if you liked it leave a like and maybe subscribe to my channel that would be uh, fun so um, yeah I'll see you guys next time with a new mod or a video uh, when I'm flying this thing uh, I now did the LVC mod and the GPS mod um, so I still need to test it out um, oh yeah also I'm recording this with my SG Cam 5000X at a frame rate of 60 frames a second in uh, uh, and the resolution is right now 1920 at 1080 I'm not recording this in 2k because it will give me um, a little bit of problems when I'm edit editing my videos um, so I'm now recording it in a resolution lower so um, well thank you guys for watching and uh, see you guys next time with a new video bye